I'm hoping that all of you have a pencil and notepad. The way that I'm going to provide your training and make sure that you have the tools necessary to be successful is by following up with some text documents most of the time if it, if it just makes sense to do and today I plan on sending all of you articles that I've written on niche marketing as well as um, developing a mission statement vision statement things like that so everything that I discuss with you today you'll be able to get and it will be basically an article that I've written and um, it's been published on the internet so that it will help you with finding your niche and also in developing a mission statement and vision statement this is so important for at the beginning stages of your business building efforts okay and um, the role that Wealth Creations Network I, the role that I want to play is that I want to be you know a, a resource that you can truly count on and you're able to um, get your business going and I mean just continually build a huge profit with it with the step-by-step -step guidance and techniques and tools and training and things like that that I provide which is absolutely free and I want you to know that I care about you and what your passion is Wealth Creations Network is my passion and yes I want you to uh, share Wealth Creations Network with others but I want you to share it with others through what you're passionate about so that people can see that Wealth Creations Network can truly be their Wealth Builders Club and not just a company out there that provides marketing tools and everything but basically their main focus is to build their own business to build the you know that business even though they say that their the marketing tools are for anything um, the more more than likely the training calls and the presentation calls are going to be about how explosive their business is and how great things are going for that business and my focus is all about you making sure that whatever it is you're passionate about you know from start to finish how to become a, a successful internet marketer marketer first step in doing that folks first step is understanding what a niche is and why it can explode your business okay it definitely will be able to because the internet provides a level playing field and so anyone and I do mean anyone can create a successful internet business with little capital or no capital okay and that's what Wealth Creations Network is all about assisting you in a zero out-of-pocket way or a very low cost way to do that never causing you to dig in your pocket because I'm upselling you every single chance I get okay this is not about that. It's about you and how you can become successful without um, breaking the bank so to speak okay now one could key component to your success is making sure that you find a captivating niche you've got to find it you have that right niche it's not going to directly compete with small companies or ma major corporations because you have an amazing niche you might have a similar product or service but your niche is what's going to set you apart from your competitors and don't worry um, I'm going to uh, explain even further in further detail what a niche is even though you see that on your screen there it says a niche provides a solution that is not being solved by mainstream marketers or companies okay that's what a niche is okay um, however I'm gonna go into a little bit more detail with you um, you can indirectly compete with major corporations that seem to have an endless advertising budget you know large corporations they spend huge advertising dollars but because they spend those dollars they have to make quick returns on their investment and they have to make heavy profits to support their overhead costs so large corporations have major overhead costs they have all kinds of things um, you know going against them so to speak especially in this economy you on the other hand you you don't have to have major expenses you shouldn't have any hanging over your head 
with the internet you have the luxury of building a slower steadier foundation of loyal customers we're going to show you how to do that as well I'm going to provide you with some tools that will help you do that now you can actually win a nice share of the market by finding the right niche okay and this will actually explode your business and as I said a niche is a solution that can be solved um, that's not being solved by mainstream marketers or by companies or organizations and I want you to think of something I want you to think of um, maybe a major food chain okay and um, because I there's this is uh, something that I use on a daily basis and I know that it's evolved ever since um, I started using it I would say about 10 years ago but um, with major food chains their perceived advantage is they provide everything for everyone but do they now a great example of a niche would be to provide a product or service major food chains have maybe overlooked or can't provide but a small segment of their cu customer population need it or they want it or both okay now for an example quite some time grocery stores didn't provide an exceptional sweetener called stevia and stevia can be up to 400 times sweeter than sugar but it doesn't have any calories or carbohydrates um, even harmful artificial ingredients there it's non-existent in stevia and even though now stevia is becoming popular you see certain things on um, on the on commercials now that basically promote stevia but there's still a niche market for it most diet products contain the regular harmful artificial ingredients and and studies have actually shown that diet products may cause you to eat to gain weight instead of their intended you know weight loss objectives so a product that has stevia in it for instance if you produce a healthy product that only uses the natural ingredient stevia as a sweetener that tastes just as good or even better than its sugar counterparts or artificial sweetener based counterparts and you could attract uh, in other words if you if you produce a product like that or if you have a find a product like that to market you could attract a nice share of the weight loss and health conscious market and this is just an example of of a niche market and personally I've ordered my sugar-free gum from an internet company that uses stevia to sweeten their gum products and most grocery stores I don't know if any I know none in, in Spokane most of them don't carry stevia gum but I there are natural health product stores that will but that's a niche you know it could just be some stevia gum <laughs> that you sell um, and this is just one example but I believe it it gives you enough information to understand what a niche is and how it could explode your business so what I want to do is help you to find your niche okay and how you find your niche is by finding the things you're most passionate about and then you can easily find you can easily find it your background your experiences successes so-called failures can help you find a perfect niche okay and we're gonna have a little bit of a an exercise I'm, I'm hoping that some of you will step up to the plate and tell me what your niche is I want you to think about what your niche is if you already have one or think about something that could possibly be a niche and share it with us so that we can comment on it but the first thing to figure out how to find is is what are you passionate about what do you love okay that's the first thing that's gonna help you find your niche um, there are things that you have learned that others who claim to be an authority on they just don't measure up in your eyes you know how many times have you seen something done and you say to yourself you know I could have done that much better you know how many times have you said that to yourself or maybe maybe you're disappointed in the way things are done currently and it seems as though everyone is following that same path but you want to be different be different and you'll have carved out a niche for your business and that's exactly what I did I got frustrated with the marketing um, 
tools, techniques, things like that that were available, the marketing um, gimmicks, you know, hurry up and, and do this. If, if you don't buy it now, it's going to go up $2,000 more. Or, you know, it just that just bothered me. Or maybe you bought into a coaching system that cost you $5,000 and it was basically, it wasn't worth $5,000, it wasn't worth 100 And I've, trust me folks, I've experienced it. Okay, so this is what has caused me to start Wealth Creations Network to help people. You know, if I'm frustrated, if I don't like something, why would I provide it? But piss, businesses do that all, all the time. They they know they don't like something, but they go ahead and do it because what? Everybody else is doing it. So they're not standing up from the crowd. But you, on the other hand, can fulfill a niche. You can find a niche just because of the things that people are doing that are status, status quo, that they're following somebody else. Okay? Um, I'm going to give you some questions to ask yourself, okay, to help you find your niche. Once again, what are you passionate about? Find your passion and you found your motivator. You, you'll find that if, you, if you're passionate about something, you'll be driven. Um, something that will give you discipline. You need um, your passion will give you discipline. Okay, it, it's it's going to cause you to get up early in the morning, stay up late. It's going to cause you to want to work on it because you love it, and that's basically a much needed component to business success. Next question is: Describe your interests. What are you interested in? What can you easily talk about? If you can talk about it you are more than likely knowledgeable enough to write about it as well and you'll find out why it's so important to be able to write about what you're passionate about because that is going to be how you communicate your niche to um, other people that you want to market to and the next question you know, or the next activity is describe your concerns what is disappointing to you how would you change it to make it better? This is really a strong uh, way to find your niche. You've, you're frustrated about something, you think it could be done better, then you do it. You make it better. If you find a problem, provide a solution, it's a quick way to find a great niche market. Perfect way. Okay? And you want to write down the answers to all of these questions, and they're going to stimulate your thinking, will help you to open up the secret to your personal niche market. So this is, you know, I'm hoping that this has helped you. Um, we have a few other things that I'm going to be covering today, and it's, it, it's helping you to uh, write out your mission statement and your vision statement. So we're going to be covering that. But right now I want to focus on your niche, and I want uh, some of you to s tell me what your what you believe your niche market is and I'll give you an example of what Wealth Creations Networks niche is and basically I fulfill a way for on any entrepreneur to access the power of building wealth online with zero out-of-pocket expense okay and it uh, that's just in a nutshell of what I do one of our members, Linda, and this is really good. One of the things that Linda um, is has found, and I believe that she's found a niche um, in the disabled arena, is finding establishments, vacation places that have disabled friendly facilities. Can you uh, tell the the rest of the team what your niche is, Linda? Because I think it's an excellent niche. For the disabled, uh, one of the things that they complain about, because I'm on Facebook with some disability groups, is they cannot, they don't have the money to take trips abroad. They need cheap vacations. Then a problem they have is hotels that cannot accommodate their needs. So your niche is finding establishments that are up to par and, and, um, making sure that folks that are disabled have just that one-stop shop, that one site that they can go to to get all of their vacationing needs, correct? Right. I think that's an awesome, that's awesome niche. I love the niche. 